So next week they got the uh, boat show here at the Jacob Javits Center, and it's January, so it's kind of it's kind of weird timing. I've never been to it before, but I happened to see a commercial the other day, and all the boats are showing up now. So it's kind of cool because you see all these boats starting to show up, and I kind of want to go. I don't know if we're going to be able to make it or not. It's, uh, next weekend's the only time I'd be able to make it because I got I think I have Tuesday off this week, and it doesn't start till I think Thursday, but. That might be something cool to check out. I don't, I don't know. I'm... What's up, everybody? Welcome to the New York Boat Show. Welcome to the Germ. Thanks for watching. Today, we are at the Jacob Javits Center in New York City at the New York Boat Show. I'm here with Jenna, and we're going to go explore the boat show. So thanks for hanging out with us. Let's go check it out. There we go. There's the boat show tickets. Oh, I like this place. We're going to be back here in April the New York Auto Show, which at that time, all this area will have cars in it. Got those tickets. Look at this, not too bad. $16 a person, 12 and under for free, so Bella gets in here for free. So Bella is gonna do the touch a boat scavenger hunt. You gotta go around, you gotta find uh, different boat manufacturers, get a stamp, and uh, it's kinda like, you don't get a prize or anything, we'll give her something. We'll give her something for doing it. Let's see, what she, let's see how she ends up doing it. Here you go. I think this is the boat I want to buy. This is a Sea Ray. Look at this. They actually allow you to go on this one. Get a little, looks like there's a bathroom down here. That looks awesome. Gotta go up there somehow. We gotta end up that way. And there's there's Sea Dew. Let's go check out Sea Dew. I think let's go check them out first because I have one of their jet skis. Look at this bad boy. This is what an old old school. Jet ski used to look like, I guess. I don't know what year that's from. I see a jet ski I like already. I just like the color ski. Look at this thing. What is this? Let's look at it. 2018 Toe Sport. Where they put the horsepower in these things. Let's see. Rotex engine. 87 octane gasoline. I don't see anything that says power. That thing is pretty nice. I like this one. I think it's time to get a new uh, new one of these. The Wake 230. Pretty cool stuff. Look at this. They actually let you go sit on this one. These are it's about a fourteen thousand dollar jet ski. Big improvement from what I have. This one actually has speakers on it. Oh man, now I want a new one. I just like the colors. I like the color scheme, and I like the speakers. That's sweet. They let you actually uh, ride on them. That, that one, you can tow like a uh, raft behind it or something like that. So it's actually a three-person one. And uh, to do three people on there, if you want to tow somebody, you have to have, uh, of course, a driver. Then you have to have a spotter, and then that's the per then you have the third person that rides on the raft. So you can't just have two people. So we got the video going there. There we go. There's the first stamp from Yamaha. Let's see. Let's say oh BRP. What's yep. that stand for? It's just the company that owns Cedu. Gotcha. Yep. Look at all the different color schemes they got. I don't know. I think I want something brighter. I'm not really in the market for a new one though. That one gonna get too old too fast with those colors because they're bright. Those bright colors tend to fade. What is this? This is the GTI. And here, here's where the uh, the starting price is at fifty three ninety nine. I don't know about that. And you can tell how fast these things can go. Look at that. Sixty five miles an hour. That's pretty fast on the uh, on the water. Anything top that now sixty five. Looks like they're all about 65. These little ones here go about 42 miles an hour. And uh, even this one here, 41 miles an hour. That thing's like all plastic. These are the cheap ones, the Spark. And these start at like 5,400. That's like, uh, that'd be perfect for a little kid. We're gonna go check out the Sea Rays now. These are the actual boats. It looks like they're gonna let us on them, so that's pretty cool. Let's go see uh, a couple of these. I'll start by going up this one right here. It's a Sea Ray 310. Look how beautiful that wood deck is. Look at 
the deck on this thing. Lounge out. We gotta see how much this thing. You wanna talk about nice? Look at this. The sink. The drains on the floors. A bunch of awesome neon. Look at the seats on this. Looks more like an airplane. This is what they call a bow rider because you actually can ride on the bow. This is basically what I own right here. Not not anything as nice as this, but uh, this is basically what I own right here, the bow rider. I don't have a cabin or a cuddy or anything like that where you can go underneath, but uh, these are nice because uh, they're nice, convenient, cozy, easy to maneuver, and uh, cool boat. We're gonna go check out some more. Okay, so Jenna has discovered how much exactly this boat is. You can have this boat. Here, special boat show price, two hundred and ninety-nine thousand four ninety-five. You know what? For two ninety-nine, we'll, we'll take two. Let's get, let's pick two of these up at the boat show. It's a special. This one here is sold. They sold this one. Look at this. Two hundred and thirty-seven thousand nine ninety-five. One hundred and sixty-three thousand MSRP. Let's go see what that $140,000 boat looks like. Reed. This is the fridge I just put on our boat. Still really nice, man, but I don't know. $137,000 is a lot of plastic on a boat for $137,000. But look at these seats. This is nice. Okay, we are on about a $400,000 sea rate. And check this out. We're sitting down in these little chairs here. This little door opens here. Whoop. And look at this. Entire bathroom down there. Nice bathroom, there's a sink. Look at this. All this stuff. I bet you this thing just takes, this drives itself. All the lighting up here, the speakers. Absolutely incredible boat. Okay, there it is. Let's see. Pull a little lever. Tight quarters. Nice little bed there. Or TV. I guess that's how you uh, change the channels there. It smells nice and new. I don't. I don't know if I could sleep right there though. Kind of small. I would go in. The three huge engines, man. I wouldn't even be able to afford the gas. We're on our way to the Sea Raid, what I call the land yachts. These are the boats that probably 1% of us could afford. Definitely not me. Maybe, maybe if every YouTuber on YouTube sent me five bucks, we could buy this uh, $800,000 boat. I don't know. This thing, I'm gonna guess that this thing is $800,000. I don't know what it's gonna cost yet. But uh, that, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking like 800 to 900,000. They'll probably have a show special with $50 off or something like that. <laughs> this thing is massive. Look at this. I don't even know what size boat this is yet. It's enormous. We really wanted to go on the land yacht, but uh, the lines just take forever. It's not a long line. It's only like 20 people in front. They're letting like one or two people on at a time. So. Uh, I to go on. It's just too long. Way too long. That boat is gigantic though. Looks, it looks really big out of the water. Let's open up her passport. Another stamp for boat safety. You want a sticker too? Sure. Nice. Thanks. We stopped at a little boat safety thing and they gave us a cool keychain. So if I drop my keys in the water, they will float. However, they will not work because they are not waterproof keys and uh, they're electronic, so they will uh, not work. But I'll have my keys. So it's not Look at this. We thought three engines was a lot. There's there's four. How fast do you really need to go? There's Chaparral. This is one of my buddy's favorite boats. Nice boats. Very expensive. Jenna likes this. Jenna wants to get this cherry red jet ski. That's probably twenty thousand dollars. It's got a beautiful paint job. I'll give you that. But it's got no speakers. What does that matter, though? It has cup holders. That's all that matters. We're 
a Yamaha, and they got another stamp for Bella. So they're gonna stamp the book. There we go, we got a whole page full You're now. You're gonna need two. Okay. Oh, we need two of them. Do you guys wanna sign up to win a free wave runner? Do we want a free wave runner? Nah, we don't need one, right? Yamaha. All right, so this really generous lady right here has given me something to give to back to you guys. So for the first time, we're gonna have a giveaway. So you guys can all buy me a beer and then crack them open with this. <laughs> awesome, so we got a bunch of these uh, bottle openers. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, buy Yamaha. These are awesome boats and jet skis. That was really cool. So we got we got a giveaway. I gotta find out, figure out a way how to give those to you guys. We gotta figure out a way. We gotta figure out something. I don't know, that's, that's gonna be a lot of postage I'm thinking of. That might have been a, not necessarily the best idea. We're still working on that P.O. Box thing, so as soon as I get that P.O. Box, we'll figure it out. But, uh, more wave runners and jet skis. What's the difference between a wave runner and a jet ski? I think a wave runner you sit down, and a jet ski is a stand up, right? Is anyone still making the jet ski? These things got so darn expensive. Oh, look at the speakers on this one. Look at the speakers on this. This has got, this has got a sound system right there. That's cool. Because I can't tell you guys, you go out on the river, and I go on the Hudson, and it kind of, believe it or not, does actually get boring. Because there's nothing to listen to. I was knocking over signs here. Gonna fix it. Uh-oh. There we go. We're going over the boats. This is the Yamaha boats. I like Yamaha. They got a jet drive, which is pretty cool. My boat's a jet drive. And uh, that's actually my boat right there. Different color. My color, I like mine better because mine is blue, which is awesome. Let's go take a tour of uh, my boat as a brand new, probably 2018, I'm guessing. Hey, this is what I have here. This is AR-195. I think mine's is AR-192, so it's probably just a new model name, but same boat. Been sitting in some place that like the insurance. So I'm gonna give you guys a tour of the brand new version of the boat that I actually own. We still don't have a name for this boat. I've had this boat for like three years and it still doesn't have a name. I'm thinking Jenny, like Forrest Gump, I don't know. And I'm gonna tell you guys something, very important when you come on a boat, step right there. Don't step on the leather or the vinyl. It's pretty much exactly what I have here. Not a very big boat, but they're not cheap folks. There's Jenna again. She's never seen the boat yet because she hasn't made it through summer yet. So this is what the interior looks like. I call it cozy. And the only thing I don't like about it is I have this top. I have a similar top to that, but my top after like three years is already ripped. That kind of stinks. We're gonna have to do some boating uh, videos this summer. This is what the console looks like and you got this nice, comfortable seat. I got the exact same seat, and this is cool. This is for, for people like me who are really short, so I can actually sit down and uh, and I can see over the wheel. That's cool, you guys, I hope you enjoyed that. You guys will get to ride on my boat when we come in the summertime. And uh, they say the two happiest days of a boat are the day you buy a boat and the day you sell your boat. This is the next one we're gonna go on. We're gonna go on the 242 Limited S series. And I know this is an accessory, but this is still absolutely insane to me that this thing has a grill on it. And uh, look at that, put it right on there. It's got a little grill. I don't know how you open, let's see. Look at that, stainless steel. I could see that being ruined after one season. Try to replace that every season. I like to step away out there. And everybody's enjoying this boat. This guy has room for everybody. It's sold. I already took it. He's already. taking it. He's taking it. He's going to be on YouTube later, so you can look for that guy. <laughs> oh, this is nice. Another Yamaha over here. I like that. See, because I like blue. Blue is my favorite color. So I like that boat. This one's kind of, the gray's kind of dull. That's the only thing I would think I would change. Maybe get some of the blue interior. And I like these mats. These are like non-slip mats. I'm gonna show you guys something else here on these. Right down here, you grab this. There's room for your skis, your fishing poles, things like that. Oh, this one's got the big screen. We're gonna find out, let's find out how much this one is. This has gotta be expensive with that screen on it. 
Alright, we gotta get off of this one. I don't know how I feel about grilling on my boat though. That's still kind of weird. I don't know. I think it's enough of the Yamaha. We gotta go down here a little bit and see what else is going on here at the boat show. We entered a chance to win. We'll never win. That'd be awesome if we did though. That'd be sick. I'll take you guys on with me. Look at this. This boat right here, well equipped. 41,000. Everybody's in the way there. 41,645. This little boat right here. You know what you're paying for? You're paying for that engine right there. That's probably a $20,000 engine. There you go. Look at that. That's that's what 41, actually 41,645 gets you. So that makes me curious to how much that one is. Well, we were standing on the wrong line. There was two lines. We thought there was a merger somewhere going on. Okay. Not a merger, a merger. Good news, everybody. They have moved the line again to originally where we were standing. And uh, I don't know, before we were we were over here. So maybe maybe we should have just stayed over there and we would have been, uh, we would have been all right. I don't know. We got a price. 847000 for this beautiful sea yacht. However, if you guys want to buy right now, before this video goes up, 650,000. Only problem is, you guys won't see this video on Monday. So uh, back to 847. We're still waiting to get on the uh, Regal yacht here. 42 feet in length. And it's got these cool pods on the bottom. They said it actually would be easier to dock this than my actual normal boat. I'm trying to keep out of the way here because I got a little people around me. But uh, they got these pods and they maneuver around. It makes it uh, easier to get, uh, get the boat docked. So that's pretty cool. We got the go ahead, Jenna. You ready? This is the boat we're gonna buy, guys. If you guys all donate twenty dollars to me, and we get five hundred thousand subscribers, we can afford this boat, and you guys would be invited on. Every one of you. Oh, look how beautiful this boat is. That's what it looks like in the river or in the ocean, I should say. Look at this dining area. They got awesome dining area right here. You can just hang out right there. Look at this. Everybody's got these big screens out. This this is insane. Look at the view from up here. Look at that view. That's insane. Is this a power sunroof up here? Is that a... That looks like a sunroof. Alright, we're gonna go down to the next level. You guys ready to go down to the next level? This is pretty crazy. Whole another level down here. Holy smokes. Look at that. Queen size bed. Nice. That's nice. Nice TV over here. Look at this, and you can you get like a little uh what do they call those things? I forget what they call those. Skylight maybe? No, it's not skylight. What do you call them? A little TV right there. Let's see what's in here. Maybe a bathroom or a closet. A little bathroom. But any bathroom on a boat is awesome. All right, there's still one more level. There's two more steps down. Two more steps down. Look at this. Low ceilings. I could almost <laughs> stand up. There is a couch here. There is a couch in the bottom of this boat. There is a couch down here. This this is pretty insane. And they, uh, this is definitely the master suite. This is uh, that is definitely a king size bed. That is perfect. And there's a window back here. I could definitely hang out in here all day. You don't need a house. <laughs> this is crazy. Wow. You gotta duck down. You gotta remember to duck though. Jenna's on the phone with her mom and her mom said she should, I should just buy this boat and then uh, we could all just live in here. Let's take you through a walk through all the way up. This is an insane boat. Nice stove and everything. Alright, and look at this. This hangout spot back here. Nice. We definitely got, when we hit the lottery, we definitely got to buy one of these. You guys can head out. We found something really cool. Alright, Geico's got their boat here. Geico Marine. Look at these guys. Look at a Geico race boat. Woo! That thing is gigantic. That's probably a real fast boat. Look at that. Geico is pretty cool, man. They always give you something free when you come to these shows. That's, that's kind of cool. And we get to 
we get to go over here. We had how many of these guys were in here? I think I guess like 130 something like that. About, about maybe. You never know. He knows. Do you know? No, they don't tell us. He doesn't tell them. He, but he opened it up before and counted them. Now we'll see. They said they'll give me a call on Wednesday. Bad news is my phone doesn't work, so <laughs> they can text me. I'll probably never get the message. So because I'm a Geico customer, I get to do a roll of the dice. Oh, we got it. she wants to be in the video. Look how bright it is. I can't barely see. All right, let's roll the dice. Bell, you want to do my roll for me? All right, there's one. We got a motorcycle, a house, and a house. We got two houses. Did we win anything? Got two matches and get a pair of glasses. Look at these. We got we got some freebies. We got some freebies from Geico. They're always good for freebies. And look at this instantly. I'm Jordan the Lion. Only a few of you guys will get that. We got some cool bikes over here to go along with the boat. There's one bike there. Now they told me over here that this was an OCC bike. I don't know if that's an OCC bike. He thinks it was. But I'm not so sure. I don't see the uh, OCC logo on there. But regardless if it is or isn't, it's a cool bike. We'll be able to tell if it's an... Oh, it is an Orange County Chopper. Look at that. Gonna tell us right there, and that's uh, right near where we live. They said they just unveiled this bike yesterday, and right there, can you guys see it? Orange County Shoppers just unveiled yesterday. You know, I was walking past this thing, and I'm like, why would they have this Jeep here? And look at this is this an amphibious car? This goes in the water, that's that's pretty wild. Look at that. It's like an aqua car. $155,000. I guess if you want to take your car with you and your boat, and you don't want to take both because the best, the best uh, gas mileage, that might be the way to go. All right, everybody, we are out of here. We're out of the New York Boat Show. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Thanks for hanging out with the germ. Bella was here today with us hanging out. Jenna was here. We had a good time. We're going to go do some other things here in New York City while we're here. Thanks, everybody, for subscribing. We're about to hit that 500 number for subscribers, so awesome. Thank you so much for everybody that's up to me. And uh, please hit like if you liked the video, and definitely hit subscribe. Thanks for watching The Germ, everybody. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe, and don't wash your hands.